hello everybody. Uh, I just kind of wanted to share something interesting that I worked on today. Uh, so this contraption is basically, it's, a, it's another adder uh, with accumulator unit like I did before. It also has the inverter incrementer combination here for uh, getting two's com complement negation. And it only uses, uh, it's not instant logic like my uh, other design. Um, so for that reason, it's a lot more compact. So you can see here I've got XOR gate, XOR gate, and then XOR gate, XOR gate again. Uh, and a very, uh, very kind of cramped layout here. Um, this is an extension of something I've done before. I've made, you know, just lone adders and incrementers. Um, you just put them together. And, and these come around, the outputs come over here to a set of eight latches like before. Um, lapis for latch. Uh, as you can see, uh, if you can read binary, it's kind of hard to get a good view, but as you can see the value 7 is locked in the latches, so that's um, coming around, that's, uh, that's the B input to the, uh, see down there there's 1, 2, 3, that's the B input to the, uh, to the adder. Um, and over here I've got, let's see, 5 is the A input, as you can see right here. So 5 plus 7 should be 12. Uh, so we come around here, and as we can see that indeed, we're getting 12 uh, as the output. Uh, and if I press this button, it'll latch that 12 in, and we'll see the values propagate. So and there we go. Uh, 12 plus 5, I get, or, yeah, 12 plus 5 is 16, 17, which is correct. So... Uh, so, as you can see, things are working uh, pretty neat. Also, I uh, haven't addressed this yet. I built the, the entire thing is built out of redstone lamps, which is really neat um, because it lets you see how uh, how data flows through um, flows through the contraption. Um, so why don't I let's see what what I'm going to do here is I'm going to click the switch and the clock signal will go around and around and around um, repeatedly latching the values right it's going to be repeatedly added 5 minus plus 5 it's kind of laggy on my machine with the lights changing um, it looks neat so I head up here and get a nice look at that And increase my field of view just so I can really see what's going on. And you can you can see how the carries propagate through, um, right? So that this these are the carries. And you can see how they uh, you can see how these little like L shapes how they propagate through as the uh, as numbers are added. It was kind of fun to watch. I thought it was worth uh, worth sharing. Um, all right. Thanks for watching.